Hi everyone, welcome to Carmen's Australian Storytime. Um, today I'm going to put on a puppet show and for book week I dressed up as the very hungry caterpillar. Love, love, love Eric Carle books. Sadly, Eric Carle has passed but his books live on and I think every child I know has at some point read this book. So let's see how well I do at putting on a puppet show of the hungry caterpillar. Sorry, the very hungry caterpillar. In the light of the moon, oh, the silvery moon, a little egg was seen sitting on a leaf. I wonder what's inside the little egg. The next day, out hatched a caterpillar. Hi everyone. My name's, um, I think I'm going to call myself Henry. And I'm actually feeling a little bit hungry. It was Monday. And on Monday, he ate a green leaf, but he was still hungry. And he thought, eh, leaves are not doing it for me. I want something better than that. And he found a juicy red apple. And he ate it all up. <coughs> Excuse you, caterpillar. No, sorry about that. Sorry about that. Uh, sorry. Um, I'm still hungry. What? After a whole apple, you're still hungry? Okay. He came across the next day. And the moon's coming up again without its smile because it fell off. The sun came. He lost his smile too. The sun came up and it was Tuesday. On Tuesday, he found two juicy pears to eat. Yeah, they look a bit delicious. Can I try them? He's such a messy eater. Yeah, I know, but they taste so good. Sounding very much like the old lady who swallowed the fly. She did a lot of that too. Yeah, I don't know who you're talking about. I'm only new, remember? I was only born two days ago. But guess what? I'm still hungry. What? Still hungry. Okay. So the moon came up and it was night time. And then the next day oh help me out now we've done monday we've done tuesday what comes next wednesday when the sun came up oh it's a food it's a food i'm so hungry i'm so hungry he came across three juicy plums one two sorry blueberries Three. Oh, they look so good. Don't rush them. Don't rush them. But I'm so hungry. <sighs> Delicious, he said. Well, isn't your tummy getting full now? No, it's not. Oh boy. What do you want now? Not leaves. Something else. Something else. So the sun went away. The moon came up. Then the sun came back. 
and it was Thursday. What are you going to eat today? I don't know, I don't know. But I, so far I've had an apple, one apple, two pears, three blueberries, and now, hmm, what can we find? And he came across four strawberries. One, two, three, four. Four juicy strawberries. How are you fitting all this in? And by the way, buddy, you're getting fatter. Yeah, last one, last one. Excuse you. Those strawberries are so delicious. They were the best I've eaten. I think that's my favorite so far. Uh, but guess what? What? I'm still hungry. Oh no. Really? Really? Yep, I'm still hungry. Okay, let's see what else we got. So, the moon came up and went down. And the sun came up and it was Friday. Um, are you sure you wanna do this on a Friday? I've come across something, it's a lot. Yep, bring it, okay. On Friday, he decided to eat five, five. I can't eat five. Can you eat five? Juicy, big oranges. Three, four, five. Ah, uh, yeah, I got this. Really? Mm -hmm. You didn't even take the skin off. Yeah, that's delicious. He's crazy. You really are getting so fat. Where are they all going? You are getting ridiculous fat. They were tasty. I don't know. I don't know now. Uh, what have I had so far? One apple, two pears, three blueberries, four strawberries, and now five oranges. Um, guess what? What? I'm still hungry. No! No! Oh. Okay. Cheese on whiskers. What are we going to feed you now? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Um, well, I'm pretty much out of all my fruit now. So let's see what else I've got in my cupboard. Let me have a look. Ah, uh, okay. The sun went away. The moon came up and went down again. And the sun came up again, and it was, what comes after Friday? Saturday. On Saturday, are you ready for this? I don't know if you're ready for this. Are you ready for this? Oh yeah, bring it, what you got for me? Here we go. A piece of cake, chocolate cake. What is chocolate cake? Oh, you've never had chocolate cake. He is going to be addicted to this, right? Everybody loves chocolate cake. Are you ready? What was that deliciousness? That was the most amazing thing ever. Yeah, I told you, chocolate cake is delicious. Uh, if 
gets better. Ice cream in a cone. What is this strange magical food? Oh man, oh man. What do you say? Excuse me, but that was delicious. Okay. I don't know if this goes with ice cream and chocolate cake, but uh, I got a pickle. Uh, what's a pickle? It's looking like a leaf. Let's have a try. Oh, ew, 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 it's so sour. Ew. But, um, hang on. No, no, it's pretty good. Pretty good. Um, buy some salami. Bring it on. Wait, the caterpillars eat meat. Hmm, I don't know. I don't know. Let's try. Hmm, I don't know about that one. It was okay, but uh, not as good as the fruit. All right, I have a piece of cheese. Swiss cheese. Swiss cheese has the holes in it. Does it make any difference what country it comes from? I don't know. Let's taste. Mmm, that was delicious. I love cheese. Cheese is the best. Uh, oh, this one? I don't know. I don't know if you should be eating this one. A lollipop. Oh. Wait. Um, I don't have a tongue. Well, don't, maybe don't eat the stick. I eat everything, remember? I'm not very hungry caterpillar. Okay, okay, here it goes. Are you choking? No, it's okay. You are crazy. Well, I am a magical caterpillar. Doesn't that mean I'm supposed to be a little bit crazy? That was so delicious. Um, I'm starting maybe to feel a little bit full, but still got room for a few more things. What about a sausage? Yep, sausages sound good. making my tummy do a little bit of a rumbly sound. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm not sure caterpillars are supposed to eat meat. I don't, I don't think, I don't think so. Hmm, maybe that's why my tummy feels a bit yucky. Uh, can you give me something else maybe to take the taste away? Okay. <sighs> I'm running out of food in my fridge. Let's have a look. <gasps> cherry pie, what a cherry pie. It's got some cherries in it. Oh, 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 this is so, so good. I literally can't see you eating any more food. Look at the size of you. You have gotten so big. Well, I hate to tell you, I'm still hungry. Are you sure? Yep, still hungry. Oh, man. Okay. Cupcake. Oh, it's so sweet and tasty. Um, guess what? What? Uh, my tummy is really starting to hurt. Is it? Mm. Well, you've eaten a lot of food this week. I wouldn't be surprised if you get a tummy ache from all that food, especially all the sweet stuff, because you know you're not supposed to have that much sweet stuff in one day. You're supposed to have it over maybe a few weeks. It's a treat food. It's not an everyday food. Well, you've been feeding it to me. True, but you asked for it, and it's all I had in my fridge. Well, have you got something else that might settle my tummy? Hmm. 
let me see. Oh, a piece of watermelon. That might help. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That looks good. That looks good. Is that fruit? Yes, it's a fruit. Oh, nice. can't talk because his mouth is so full. That better? Yeah. Oh, it's really hard to talk now. I'm so full of food and my tummy's really hurting. Oh. Do I need to take you to the doctor? No. No, I'm not a doctor. What do you want me to do? Mm. Uh, I need to go to sleep. I'm so full. I warned you about this. And I warned you about eating healthy too. All right, let's see. We'll put you to bed. You can have a little rest. Oh, oh. Okay. So the moon came up and Caterpillar slept and slept and slept. And the next day, when the sun came up, he felt much better. How are we feeling this morning, Caterpillar? Mm, I, I, I feel good. I think I feel good. But I, I'm not sure, like you said, that I should eat all that food. Um, especially all the junk food at once. The junk food was, I think, the thing. Because I ate all the fruit and the fruit was okay. That's the junk food. Maybe it is a treat food, a sometimes food. I think. Yeah, well, I did tell you this. This is the rule. Okay, as much as we want it, it's not good for us. And you have gotten incredibly, incredibly large. So, um, what about today? Because today is, uh, what day is it? We've had Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. It must be Sunday. Sunday. How about you just have one juicy leaf. Yeah, that sounds great. That sounds really great. Yeah. That bit of spirit is better than that. What? I said that is a gun and turn in I can't understand you. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Oh. oh, there we go. That's better. What did you say? I said, I don't want any more food. What? You're actually full now. Yeah. I don't want any more food. I'm done. Can I just have a big sleep now? I just want to sleep. I, I think that's what caterpillars do. Really? Yeah. I think they eat and eat and eat and eat and eat until they get so fat they can't fit any more food in and then they have a sleep. I'm ready. I'm ready for that. Okay. So, the caterpillar spun himself a cocoon and he hopped into the cocoon for his big sleep. He spun and spun and spun and spun his way into the cocoon. And he sat in the cocoon for two whole weeks. After the two weeks was up, he woke up from his sleep, but he wasn't a hungry caterpillar anymore. He came out of the cocoon as a butterfly. A beautiful, beautiful butterfly. And what do butterflies do? They wait for it. Fly! 
try that again. They... He's a bit crushed from being in his cocoon, so maybe it takes a few goes for a real butterfly as well. They... Fly. He flew! And that is the story of how the very hungry caterpillar became a beautiful butterfly. Can you remember all of the things he ate? An apple, two pears, three plums, or sometimes people say three blueberries. It doesn't matter which story. Four strawberries, five oranges, five oranges. I can still can't believe he did that. And then um, 10 different things, chocolate cake, ice cream, pickle, what was after the pickle? Salami, Swiss cheese, Swiss cheese was lollipop, hot dog, cherry pie, cupcake, and he finished with a nice piece of watermelon. 10 things in one day and 10 lots of junk in one day. I don't know about that. And then he finished with one nice juicy leaf. And then he had a little sleep for two weeks and then he became the beautiful butterfly. Thank you for joining me on Carmen's Australian Storytime. Definitely one for the bookshelf and I hope you enjoyed watching this today. Don't forget to click and subscribe. Bye for now.